Hi, I would like to discuss with you of the course Upmax Intro Day 1, the login session. So where is that session? Well, if you go home to the home page, it's like the first real session. So it's in the basic use with visual tools. And um, it's, this is about well logging in via a remote desktop environment. And first we have login in general, which you can find here too. So what I'll be doing is I'll go you uh, go through the exercises of it. I'm not going to read it um, because well you you should do it that yourself. So let's see if I if the exercises are correct. Go to the Upmax documentation at there. Let's take a look if it works. So I pressed Control Left Mouse button to put it in a tab. Yeah, that's the documentation. Great. Where is it described how to log in to Rackham? I'm just going to search login Rackham. Login to Rackham. Mm -hmm. So there are multiple. Oh, there it is. Login to Rackham. All right. So I found it. How many environments can one log into? How do they look like? Well, let's take a look. Scroll a bit. Ah, all right, all right, all right. So here I see some kind of environment with a. It's a bit small, maybe, but it looks like well a regular desktop like this. So let's go back to the web page there. So that's one. Here we see like something that looks like a terminal. And here we see another thing that looks like a uh, regular operators like Windows or Mac or, uh, or Ubuntu like what I have. So how many environments is the question? So I would say two. One is like visual and one is like text. Two, correct. The documentation of how to log into Rackham states after logging in, one is on a login node. Where is it described? What, where it is described? What a login node? All right. So what is a login node? I guess that's the question. What is a login node? Ah, all right. Well, I just guess I need to click this. A login node. Uh huh. This needs to render. All right. I found the the answer. So I found the page, this login node, that is the same thing. Yeah, that looks the same, login node here. Yeah, correct. What is a login node? Well, so a login node is the computer you arrive, it's a shared resource. What should you do? Only do light and do only short and light things on the login node. Okay. So a login node is a computer you can find it yourself. Yeah, well, well copy pasted. Should the examples below be done on the Rackham login node? What is your reasoning? So on a Rackham login node or in a login node in general, you should do only do short and light things. And here are some examples. I'll just go through the questions because I know these examples. Create a directory. Absolute do on a login node. Copy a data set of 100 gigabytes to another folder. You can do that on a login node um, because um, it is one thing, one time thing. Sure, you can schedule it, but I think copying it doesn't take too much processor power. I think you can do this. When in doubt, use a compute node or an interactive node. Download a data set. Uh, that's also, you can do that on a login node because it's also a one-time thing. Edit a file using an IDE such as RStudio VS Codium or VS Codium. That you don't do on a login node. That's a big thing. You start an editor that uses a lot of uh, CPU power. Uh, you, this is a long process. So don't do this on an interactive node. It's called an interactive node where you, be, where you will be doing this. If you use a simple text that's like Emacs, Nano or Vim, probably Nano as a beginner, sure you can do that on a login node. Here to run a bash next to a Python or R script, that is typically something you do on a compute node. It's not, you, you don't need to be there. It is, um, it's not interactive. So you can submit this as a batch script um, and then a compute node will run it. All right, um, well, that was this lesson already. I guess the goal is to 
find out that there are oh yeah that there are two environments that you are on the login node of the login that the login node is a shared resource that everyone uses um, and that you should only run light commands so here i've went through the exercises of the session about login i wish you a very good day bye